At the heart of the Naruto Photo Lab system is Easy Controller software. In this overview of Easy Controller, we will look at some of the various screens and menus within Easy Controller. The first items we look at are the Easy Controller navigation buttons. These are located at the top of the screen by default. The four main buttons are the orange button for the main screen display, the green input display button, the purple PRM or photo retouch module display button, and the pink settings display button. The pink settings button is only active when the setting menu is open. Also, the gray air attention button is only active when there is an error or attention message displayed. This button will turn yellow to alert the operator. The brown buttons are help menus for items loaded on this computer, such as Easy Controller and the QSS Green 2 printer. We will start by taking a quick look at the Easy Controller help menu. On the main screen of the help menu, there is a What's New function. This informs the operator of any changes that may occur when the Easy Controller software is upgraded to a new version. There is also a How to Use the Help menu, a Basic Printing Operations menu, a quick reference guide, and a glossary. The Naritsu Easy Lab function is not generally used. To locate individual manuals, select the Show button in the upper left corner. The first item on the list is the operator's manual. This is the most comprehensive of the manuals and contains information about all relevant functions and operations of Easy Controller. The troubleshooting manual contains information regarding the error and attention messages. Usually this manual is accessed from the actual error or attention message. You will find a link in the message in the lower right hand corner that will take you directly to the page in the manual that describes the message. The Image Editing Operator's Manual is used for producing green cards or other specialty prints directly from Easy Controller. The Starting Guide is a very good manual to help familiarize you with Easy Controller. It contains most of the basic functions of Easy Controller. The Multipurpose Format Creation Software Manual is used for creating custom greeting cards, package prints, and index prints. Custom greeting cards and package prints require additional optional software to work. The manual at the bottom of the list is for direct connection of a film processor to Easy Controller. It is a good idea to explore the manuals to become more familiar with the system. The main screen of Easy Controller is where orders come in for processing. Access this screen by selecting the orange main display button. This is where orders come to be processed. The orders in the preceding screen are orders to be processed. The orders on the process screen have already been processed. On the right hand side of the screen are various controls. Starting from the top, we have the output media button that is used when manually processing orders and burning to a CD or DVD. The top and bottom buttons are used for changing the priority of an order. The start pause button is used to start or pause an order. The information button will give details regarding a selected order. The interrupt button is used to interrupt an order so that a high priority order may be processed. The delete button is used to remove an order from the preceding screen. We will discuss these buttons in greater detail in the order processing session. The large green start stop button is used for pausing the entire print queue. When the queue is active, this button will be green. When the queue is paused, this button will be gray. Also, when the queue is paused, the main display button will flash red and yellow. The printer status box is where information about printers attached to Easy Controller resides. Easy Controller can control up to eight printers, although in this example we only have two printers. When the printer is highlighted, information regarding paper loaded is displayed. For more printer status information, select the information button. Finally, there is a function button in the lower left-hand corner. 
the button gives us access to various settings. While in the settings display, we can move between screens using the navigation buttons. While the settings display is active, a little black arrow will appear above it. Details about the settings may be found in the Easy Controller Manual. Enter the Input Display screen by selecting the green Input Display button at the top of the screen. In this display, we are able to run orders directly into Easy Controller. Print sizes are made available by selecting a print channel. The print channels are found listed under the Display Table button. This display also gives us the option to add an index print to the order or a CD or DVD to the order. The order may be placed from several different types of inputs by selecting the Input button. Available inputs will appear here. Unavailable inputs will be grayed out. The printing method may also be selected on this display. The choices are automatic, prejudge printing, or preprint inspection. Automatic prints without operators seeing the images. Prejudge printing allows the operator to preview the images and make corrections as needed. Preprint inspection allows the operator to preview the images for a preset time, for example, three seconds. And if the operator does not make any changes, the images will print. We will look at the printing functions in greater detail in the order processing overview. For more information, please consult your manuals.